of a little personal favorite. Um, this will be available in the winner's choice waffle that I do. Um, I grew up being a massive um, McDonnell Douglas Apache fan. So um, this is one of my AH-64 McDonnell Douglas Apache dials. Uh, it's in silver and we painted it in uh, green, dabbed it off so it kind of just stayed around the high points on there, then loomed it. Um, it is in a brushed case. This is a vintage brass bezel and I just left it distressed and rough looking. Um, painted in black, uh, but I left all the distress markers all the way around there. You got your star with the circle military style uh, crown on there. Um, low profile exhibition case back. I did a uh, gilded rotor stainless steel movement holder in there. Uh, then I went with a gold handset with a custom painted seconds hand. That's uh, brassy gold with a green pip uh, to match the background. And then this is on one of my custom two piece super soft canvas and leather straps. Very soft, very pliable with a brushed buckle. So that is the build. Um, as with every build, bezel will turn left, bezel will turn right. Um, I put them on there a little bit tighter. Now with this one being so low profile and harder to kind of grab, it's it will be tough for you to bump this one. Um, it's just it's not out to the side, you know. So you're you're not pushing it there. You can see that gap there. Um, Automatic mechanical, so you can wind it, you can wear it, you can put it in a watch winder. But if it's dead or you're not going to be very active, make sure you wind it just a little bit so you don't lose time. And how you do that is you back the crown off the threads until you hear it clicking. When you do, twist it that way. If you do it for four or five seconds, uh, I go back and forth on it. Going this way doesn't do anything, but it's a lot easier to just maintain your finger spacing and just go back and forth. If you do this for four or five seconds before you put it on, even if you're not very active, you will keep time. And if you do it for something closer to 20 seconds, you're going to max out your 31 plus hour power reserve on it. You cannot overwind it. When you feel like you're done winding, pull it to the one and only click. You can now set your time. You'll notice you've got a wobble crown that it's just a little bit. It deflects lateral pressure from going into the stem, putting pressure on the movement. Uh, if you don't like that it pushes and and, and pulls, uh, that's because you're doing it. Uh, just pull it a little bit straight. You won't feel that anymore. Okay, Google, what time is it? It's 1246 p.m. 12.46 p.m. When you're good, push it back over, get it out of that time setting, and then re-thread it back down. And that is the build. So... Um, like I said, big fan of uh, the Apaches, so that is what this build is. And uh, like I said, nice vintage uh, brass dial on there. Um, thought they look good together. Uh, as with every build, come with matching beads. Entirely up to you whether you wear them or not. This one's going to come in a brown special edition BBW box. It's going to come with watch cleaners. It's good on all glass and metal parts, so everything there in the center. Leather conditioner, this is good to keep this leather strap perfectly soft. Um, you'd probably apply it more so on the back. Um, if you ever feel it's getting rough or hard, just apply some, rub it in, uh, let it soak, and um, remove any excess. And then lastly, some fine scratch remover. This is Novus 2 from Amazon, just repackaged. Uh, this is an acrylic glass, and you can scratch it, but if you do, put a tiny bit on it and buff it out using your included microfiber. Generate some heat with your thumb and you should buff it out in about 20 seconds and it will be good as new. So that's the build and if you want it, congrats. Uh, I hope you love it. Uh, thank you for your support. And if you want me to build you something custom unique, reach out and I'll see what I can do. And if you want to continue to see videos like this, like and subscribe as I put them up all the time. Thanks for your time, guys.